now it is time to take our chatbot to the next level. And we are going to do that by using keywords. Keywords allow you to automatically reply to questions of your users. And if we set this up right, we can really scale up our chatbot conversations. Let's dive in. So if you are inside ChatFuel, you can just click on blank bot, which is the chatbot that we created, and then we will go to the setup AI. And here you can set up your automatic messages. So you can make different groups. For example, you can make a default group, the welcome message group, a restaurant menu group. I will not use the groups right now, but I will just show you that, that it works and then we get set, set different AI rules per group. And then if the user says something similar to a certain phrase, then we can automatically reply with a block or with a text. And before we're going to do that, I will just say that I always reply with a block or with a flow in ChatFuel. I don't recommend to automatically reply with a text. And that's for two reasons. One, if we reply with a text, you can see here, we can only reply with text. We cannot add buttons, we cannot add images, we cannot add videos. It's just a text reply. So it's limited in the amount of media that we can use. That's one. And the second thing is about the structure and the overview of your bot. If you have messages in the setup AI section, but also flows in the flow section, you don't see all the messages and conversations of your chatbot in one overview. And I like to have all my messages and flows in one overview. So that's why I recommend to just use flows or blocks with the setup AI function. So now we're going to set this up. So for example, if a user says something similar to hi or hey, or hello, or howdy, or salute, then we will automatically reply with our welcome message. So that's the welcome message. Then we add another rule, for example, for making a reservation. So we can type in reservation, and we will add the block make reservation. Also, people want to find out about our menu. Then we can just type in menu, and this automatically will go to the restaurant menu flow that we made before. And the last but not least is the dessert recipe. So if someone types in recipe, it will automatically go to our secret dessert recipe. So how do we know that this is actually working? If we go to Messenger and we go to our Facebook page, and for example, we just type in, hey, then it will automatically go to our welcome message. If we type in menu, then you will see our most famous meals. If we select reservation, if we type in reservation, okay, awesome, Joran, you can give us a call or create a reservation on our website. And also, if we want our recipe, you, they can ask for your email. So that's working. But I also want to tell you that the, the setup AI is kind of smart. So for example, instead of typing in a reservation, we're typing in reservations, or that will also trigger it, or we can type in make a reservation, that will also trigger it. So every phrase or every word where there is reservation, Jeff Hill knows how to reply to it, and it will reply with the right flow. If you want more videos on how you can use tablets in your marketing, please subscribe to my channel. Oh, and if you didn't do it yet, please hit the like button below.